Well, Moab uh, is the perfect mecca for the off-road, uh, and uh, at Mopar, uh, one of our missions is to support uh, Jeep uh, and uh, to give the opportunity to the enthusiasts to have uh, performance and accessories to bring uh, Jeeps to the extreme performance. Well, you know, every single year we take different things, and, and it's, it's exactly the same this year. Not only are we looking at different lift kits, different axles, we have concept in terms of the hoods, in terms of heat um, displacement, different colours, different interiors. So it's a really broad range of new things that we're going to try that range from accessories to powertrains to lift kits to wheels and tyres. So it's going to be another exciting year in Moab. Well, you know, it's, it's always been a, um, a great venue for us to get that direct feedback. And some of the things that you now see within Jeep or within Mopar in terms of accessories come specifically from that feedback that we've had. You know, Dozer Colour was first showcased down in Moab. The reaction was great. It's now within our colour portal. We have a new colour that we're going to showcase down there again this year so we'll get feedback from that. The new portal axles that we have on the FC, again we use those down in Moab, great customer reaction is now available through Mopar and their accessories. So one of our routes is that we try to trans transfer everything we put in the prototypes into production and uh, normally what you see as a prototype at Moab is going to be in production and accessible as a uh, performance and accessories the next year. We have more than thousands uh, accessories and performance parts for Jeep and we keep on adding new um, parts uh, every year. We are introducing a couple of important new parts, a portal axle that is a derivation of uh, the prototype uh, called the Immortal that we showcased in uh, Moab two years ago and a Hemi, uh, Hemi engine transformation kit for the Wrangler that as usual is going to gather a lot of uh, interest from the enthusiasts that would like to bring uh, the, the Wrangler to really the next uh, step in terms of extreme performance uh, uh, from an off-road standpoint. For me, when we think about how Wrangler develops into the future, there are a few things that we get constant feedback on. One is diesel, one is pickup, and obviously you need to be careful when you take a vehicle like Wrangler for its next generation. But factoring those things in and the feedback that we've had right now when we're at the early stages of thinking about the next Wrangler is very important because then we can think about how we design those things maybe into that vehicle program. So again, we're expecting similar feedback this year.